Hey y'all, hey, welcome and welcome back to my channel. I am Nikki, I'm Nicole, and you're watching Life with Nikki Nicole. Welcome back to another vlog dump. This is vlog dump number two. Now listen, if you're new to the channel, hey, like this, comment, and let me know where you're watching from. Also, if you continue to watch and you like what you see, go ahead and turn that red subscribe button gray for me and become a part of the Life family. We would love to have you over here. It's free 99 to join. Anyway, you guys, in today's vlog, we will be traveling to Louisiana for a weekend of celebration. We'll be celebrating a 50th birthday. Also, we will be preparing to travel and a little bit of self-care. Again, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Hit that notification bell so you can know every time that I upload a video. Welcome back to Vlog Dump number two. Friday. Happy Friday, you guys. How's everyone doing? I hope everyone is well. So you already know what time it is. It is time for another weekend vlog. Hopefully by this time I have completely gotten caught up on my vlogs. But anyway, good morning to you. I am Nikki. I'm Nicole and you are watching Life with Nikki Nicole. And if you are new to the channel, watching me for the first time or you just been hanging out with the fam go ahead and become a part of the family it's real simple it's free 99 to join the family all you got to do is hit that subscribe button boom you're automatically a part of the life family when you become a part of the life family of course we're going to do everything that we can to make you not make you but yes to make you feel your worth we're going to love on you. We're actually going to do everything that we can to show you love and kindness as God leads us to show you. But anyway, you guys, as you can see, I am in a hotel room. So this is actually going to be the beginning of a travel vlog. So yesterday, yes, we did travel. I'm in Louisiana for the weekend. Right now, I'm doing just a little private time. No one even knows that I'm here yet. But we, I came in for my sister that if you saw the last vlog um, that came and spent the week with me, um, her birthday, her 50th birthday is today. I'm getting ready to call her. Anyway, I forgot. Today is her birthday, so I'm getting ready to call her and wish her a Cinco de Mayo birthday. So happy Cinco de Mayo, you guys! For everyone that's celebrating Cinco de Mayo today, make sure you be safe out there. Make sure you take God along with you. Make sure you pray before you go. Ask for travel and grace and mercy all day. But anyway, you guys, so she doesn't know I'm here yet. She knows I'm coming, but she doesn't know I'm here yet. So I'm about to get ready to call her and wish her a happy birthday and all that type of stuff. But anyway, you guys, I just wanted to come in and start the weekend vlog. This is a bit of a travel vlog because Sunday... I am going to El Paso. Yes, I have been blessed with a trip to go to El Paso. I'm going with my mom. I'm going down to visit my baby brother. Haven't seen him in years. He's military and they move around so much. And so I haven't seen him in two years. I haven't seen him since my last, since my brother next to me, which is my baby brother as well, um, went to be with the Lord, passed away and everything. So that's the last time. My brother, I actually seen my brother because he lives in El Paso, Texas. I'm actually in Houston, Texas, which is about eight hours apart. We've been discussing getting together, but he works a lot. And then he has some things going on with him and stuff like that. So anyway, we're going to spend time with him. We're going to be in El Paso for five days. So I'm super excited about that. God is beginning to bless me um, to travel and do different things. And I'm so grateful unto him. I was feeling guilty about the trip i'm like lord we really don't want my mom to pay for this trip you know i you know there's something that you know I, i'm used to doing things for her and god just spoke to me and he said allow me to bless you so it's a blessing to be able to take this trip and i'm grateful to god for it but anyway well i'm not gonna bore your patience y'all not even dressed yet i just want to come in and start the weekend vlog and um yeah so this is our room for the next three days um nothing fancy but it ain't bad either so this is the room we got a little one of uh bed it's just me and my daughter in here 
um, Cadis is with his people. We're from Louisiana, but we just chose to get a room. And yeah, so let me try to give y'all a little tour. You see the bed. Um, I'm going backwards. It's the TV and stuff. Stuff like that. Not a whole lot of ecstatics going on in here, you know, but it ain't, it ain't bad, okay? So, this is the bathroom. Your makeup area, let me turn around so y'all can see it. Let me just, let me just turn on. This is the bathroom area. As you can see, I got all my personal stuff on there because I told you we moved, we came, um, we uh, moved in for the weekend. Last night, this is the bathroom, nothing fancy. You know, just something to chill out with for a couple of days before um, we head out to El Paso. So I'll be meeting up with my mom on Sunday. We're gonna leave Sunday morning. So yeah, this is where we're staying for the weekend. It's okay. Well, I've stayed at this hotel before and I had a much nicer room. I don't know what this is about, but Oh, well, it'll do. Anyway, you guys, so this is it. Now, this is just the beginning. All right, y'all. So like I said, this is the, the weekend vlog, semi-travel vlog. So I'm already packed. I have everything already packed for El Paso. I ain't taking all this stuff out for y'all to see. I'm just not going to do that. But I got everything packed. Basically, I just bought a lot of, like, little summer dresses and stuff. But I forgot to get my sweater just in case because you know how the weather be. So I'm going to have to go somewhere and grab like a little sweater or jacket or something just in case the weather change you gotta always be prepared because i definitely don't want um to get sick or anything like this so yeah so this is it for right now i will come back and talk to you guys later i do want to go and see a friend of mine um uh, my best friend well one of my best friends growing up her name is nicole she lost her son to a tragedy and I really want to go see her today. Um, he unfortunately was um, killed by his wife. I don't know all the details. Or none, of, none of that. I'm not sure. But I do just want to go, you know, show her some love on today. So I'm going to try to do that um, later on. That's something I'm not going to vlog. So, but um, yeah, I really want to go and see her because my heart goes out to her because I know what it feels like to lose a son um no matter how you lose your child whether it's sickness or tragedy it's all still grief and i know what that feels like so i really want to go and see her um i try reaching out to her but of course when you're going through that you don't want to reply to nobody you don't want to talk i understand the feeling and i am not offended at all but i do want to try to reach out to her and try to go see her today but y'all, so let me go ahead and get myself together. I already made me some coffee. I've been drunk some coffee. I've talked to my mom. And yeah, so let's go ahead and get this day, this day started. It's the intimate oh, right. Porsche Pink. It is a place where you can come and get your little JJ detox and just have a nice time. So I came in to see my sister and also book an appointment with her so I can um, support her. So my appointment will be tomorrow. And of course, I'm gonna bring y'all with me so y'all can see, but right now, there are other people getting their work done and I will not um, disturb their privacy, but I'm just gonna show y'all her waiting area. Just a, real quick, give me just a second. It's music playing, so you know, um, I'm here when we get out of here. I'm gonna show y'all the weather area, how beautiful it is, how comfy it is, how cozy it is. All right, so here we go. Hey y'all, how y'all doing? So yeah, I already been out and about, but I had to come. I came home really quick. I'm going to um, do a little something, something to my face, and I'm getting ready to go to y'all. I don't know why my eyes are so, my eyes have been red all day, and I don't know why. But I'm getting ready to, back in the room, I'm getting ready to just, I already started, 
I'm just gonna pop on some eyelashes right quick and maybe, you know, conceal under here just a little bit. But I'm getting ready to, remember I told y'all this morning about my friend that I wanted to see. So I'm gonna go to her songs. They're gonna do a, like a memory of balloon release for him. Um, today is six, so I'm afraid I'm freshening up really quick and then I'm gonna go and um, support her, pay my respects and go see her, you know, really quick and support her and what she's doing today in memory of her son. So I'm getting ready to do that. I just want to come in and chit chat with you guys a little bit <clears throat> as we go through um, the weekend and with, you know, all that good stuff, y'all. I gotta get back in the gym when I tell y'all I am blowing up, I am blowing up. I don't know if I'm just bloated or what it is, but mm -mm. So, this is the look for today, y'all, as far as the hair. And uh, I think I did a pretty good job with laying it down, which I think it was already um, styled by my daughter, who is a, a hairstylist. She styled it, and then I put it on myself. So, anyways, you guys, so I'm about to get ready to um, finish getting ready. And... Um, so I can be ready when my daughter gets here. She gets off work, even though we came, she works from home, we came down today. So she went to a friend of hers house so she could, you know, complete her day of work. So when she gets back, I'm gonna go ahead and go <clears throat> to where they're having um, the the, dead of them, the balloon release at, which is not, I mean, maybe about five minutes away from where the hotel that we're staying in. So yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and um do that and so then so let me go ahead and pop these eyelashes on y'all and i think while i'm waiting on my daughter i'm gonna go ahead and put my nails on we'll see but i'm gonna come back and chit chat with you guys a little later peace hey you guys so i am back unfortunately y'all i did not get a chance to go and um pay my respect and support um my sister on today i did not get a chance to go to the balloon release um I've been sitting here waiting on my daughter <laughs> since about, I want to say about 545 or so. I, I, you know, she went and got her hair redid, so they pushed everything back, and that's why I didn't get my car fixed, y'all. But anyway, I'm really disappointed. I'm really disappointed about that because I really wanted to go and pay my respects and, and show her some love, you know, because sometimes people can gain strength from those who have gone through that, who have gone through um, losing a child or losing a loved one. And when they see your face, sometimes that gives them the strength to push and endure. But I'm definitely, definitely praying for her. I hope I get a chance to see her before I leave Louisiana. But I'm really disappointed, y'all. That's really breaking my heart because I didn't get a chance to go. Um, but anyway, y'all, as y'all can see, I did do my nails. Um, let me show y'all what I used. I chose this color because it's the perfect color for summer. Um, but also, hold on, y'all. Okay, that's better. I chose this color, y'all, because it's a perfect color for summer. And then also, my toes are already this color. When I got my pedicure, pedicure did um, a couple of weeks back, I got this color as well. So. These are the nails that I use right here. They're Goldfinger, my Goldfinger. Goldfinger is a brand. I normally, I love, they have this light, light pink color that I love, love to wear. And they look very natural. As you can see, they're not too long, um, but they're long enough. Um, you can find these on their website. They do have goldfinger.com or you can find these in a local beauty supply. I actually purchased these the last time I came when I came to pick my sister up when she stayed with me for our women's conference and you should have seen that vlog by now as well um and so i picked these up um then and they were six dollars and 99 cents and so yeah i got these from there um from the local beauty supply place here actually in louisiana where i'm at right now um it's called dollar mania but like i said you can i saw these on the website and then when I went in the store, um, they had them. So I went ahead and purchased them. But you can also get them off goldfinger.com. They have all type of colors you can choose from. But anyway, so these are 
the ones that I put on today. Now, I didn't do my normal routine, which is normally what I do is clean my nails, get all the cuticles and everything off, and then I put the nails on and I use my UV lamp to seal them, and then I put a beacon. I use the beacon top coat to um, put on top of them, and then I put them under there again, and they get that that makes them hard. So. I didn't do that this time because I didn't bring my UV light and I need to get some more top coat. So hopefully they will stay on um, while I'm in El Paso. Hopefully, if not, I probably have to uh, redo them or put on some more. But these are the nails, you guys. Let me show you the other hand. So anyway, you guys, um, yeah, it doesn't look like I'm gonna be doing anything else tonight. My daughters are going out for Cinco de Mayo. So the only way if I have the car, but if I don't, I will be in tonight just chilling. So if I don't come back and talk to you guys later, that means that I was in chilling. I might come back and talk to you guys later because I do have to go run to Walmart once she gets here and um, pick up something. And I'm starving, I'm hungry, so I gotta go get me something to eat. I need to eat. I really wanna go sit down and eat, but I don't know. We'll see. But anyway, I just wanted to come in and just chit chat with you guys a little bit, let you know the update that I did not get a chance to go to the balloon release and everything. But like I say, um, she's in my heart. And I, I've definitely been praying for her daily, for her strength, for her endurance. You know, that God will give her joy in the midst of her sorrow and peace. Let peace be upon her and let her feel his presence, you know, as she go through this journey. Whew, when I tell y'all, it don't, it, 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 you, you, you endure, put it like that. Some say it gets easy. I'm going to say you endure because it's not a, not a time that you don't think about your loved one, the one that you lost, and especially if it's a child, losing your losing my son changed my whole life, my whole outlook on things. And so I know what she's going through to lose her son and the way she lost her son, you know what I'm saying? It's a tragedy, you know, something he did not deserve, you know? And so my heart just goes out to her. But anyway, you guys, I just want to come in and chit chat with you um, really quick. And so, yeah, I'm gonna come back and talk to you guys later. Good morning, you guys. Happy Saturday unto you. So, I am, we're um, out and about today. Um, the reason, one of the reasons why, um, I, I, think, I think I told y'all, I don't know if I told y'all. I think I did. But today is my sister's, their 50th birthday party. So, I'm out and about. I'm getting ready to make some um, sandwich trays for her. Um, so I'm out and about. I'm going to um, try to see if I can find an uh, outfit really quick because their colors is like rose gold and black. And I don't, I didn't bring, I don't have any. I think I got one, one. I didn't bring anything that color. So I'm gonna try to see if I can find something um, simple but cute. Um, and then I'm gonna meet up with her and make the sandwiches and stuff and get ready for their party on tonight. And then we'll just see what the day holds. So I just came in to start. Um, hang on, y'all. My daughter's calling. Hey, you guys. <clears throat> I'm sorry about uh, the view. Um, but this is the best that I can do right now because I'm about to drive. But anyway, y'all, uh, um, I'm back. I'm on my way. Like I was telling y'all, I'm getting ready um, to help make some some sandwich hors d'oeuvres for my sister's party but y'all know i told y'all yesterday i have an appointment today for two o'clock she changed it it was gonna be at one but she changed it to two which is good it gives me time to do what i need to do really quick but i have an appointment y'all to get to do my um bee steam today and basically what it is is the uh the jj detox so I'm having it done today. I am supporting one of my sisters. I always call my friends my sister, so I'm supporting one of my sisters um, today. Um, her business, and it's called Coach Pink. And I'm gonna give y'all a little bit more details once we get there, and I begin the process of the beast theme. I'm super excited about that. It's my 
my first time ever getting into a JJ detox. So that's what we're gonna do um, today. So it's a bee steam detox and you know it, um, I asked her how often should I do it and she was saying, you know, some um, I'm gonna try it once a month, try to come and do it once a month. But I may update and, and do it more frequently. Um, so we shall see. But this is gonna be my first time, so I'm super excited about that. I just want to come on and talk about that really quick. regulates menstrual cycle, reduces heavy bleeding and clotting, prevents chronic yeast and vagina infection, strengthens, tightens, and tones the vagina wall, corrects absence and irregular menstruation, heals vagina tearing, scarring from C-sections, etc. Helps heal hemorrhoids and so much more. I have an Hey you guys, so I am finally finished. Um, I also got my eyebrows waxed today, but I just finished with um, my um, B Stream Detox, which Detox, which is the VJJ Detox. I gotta go fix this wig; it's, it's coming off because um, it's not glued down. So, anyways, um. And y'all, I feel so different. It's just like, I feel, I don't know. It, it, I feel so different. I feel relaxed. I feel like we're going to see, you know. But it was very relaxing, very enjoyable. And I recommend it um, for our ladies, especially um, if you have some of the problems that are listed in the video, you know, what it helps with. You know, I'm super, super, I feel amazing. I'm so glad I got it done. And so now I'm about to get ready to go and get myself together for this evening. Now I'm taking my time walking down the steps. So anyway, because we had to go up on the third. I was on the third floor. Three flights of stairs to the shop. But anyway, y'all, so I feel amazing, like, I feel so relaxed. Like I felt like, honestly, like in my um, certain areas, it felt really tight. It's just like I feel so relaxed. Everything is just feels relaxed down there. Like I feel good. <laughs> so I will be continuing to do this as a part of my self care. You know, re resume is very relaxing, y'all. And of course, she made the experience amazing. Soft music, cozy, little wine, little snacks, you know. Um, you definitely have to keep yourself dehydrated. Now, when I was filling out my um, 
my form, I have to do a release form or whatever. It was saying something about being a little dizzy. You know, when, when I first began, when it first started, I began to feel the steam from the herbs and stuff. Um, I was, I did get a little dizzy, um, but it, it wore off. But you do sweat, you know, so that's why you completely unfold itself for the um, V stream, the V stream, the uh, V V stream stream. <laughs> the beach stream gown other than that you have nothing on you know but your bra if you choose to um but yeah it's well worth it and i would make recommend it to anyone so you guys i'm about to uh head back to my room and um get ready for tonight so i'll chat with you guys later